Hello, and welcome to a quick video about citing indirectly. Let's say you want to quote this article for an assignment. The article is spirituality and religiosity are associated with quality of life in patients with lung disease. You want to cite this evidence found in the literature review or introduction of that article about the quality of life related to spirituality of the individual. So here, this person is saying, that on the other hand, there was a positive association with immune function, quality of life, and emotions, such as hope, optimism, and purpose meeting. So you would want to quote or put a direct quote about how having spirituality leads to a better quality of life. So if you're doing that, which are the correct citations? One quotes the article where we're getting it from through the literature review introduction. And one of these citations is the in-text citation used in the lit review of the study that they were citing. The correct answer is that you need to cite from the original source. So though it was an article written by Duarte, Lucetti, Tixera, and Rigato from 2020, if you were citing that particular part about that there is evidence related to spirituality leading to better outcomes from that section, particularly a direct quote, you would need to cite from Conan King Carson from the Handbook of Religion and Health. So just a couple tips about direct and indirect citing. Thinking about, are you quoting a source directly? Yes, make sure that your quote is under 20, 40 words if it's a direct quotation. Put page or paragraph number with quotation marks. Make sure that you have an in-text citation that has a corresponding bibliographic citation. If you're using Conan 2012, you would need to have the full citation in the bibliography as well. If your quote or citation references another source, you'll need to cite that source. So that is called an indirect citation. Ideally, you're gonna pull direct quotes from the original source, whether you found it in a scholarly or popular source. So if you see a peer-reviewed article cited on a website, for example, you would need to cite the peer-reviewed article on the website, not the website. 